Being a confused, we know God, and we know the Prince of Peace, and therefore we have peace. Let's clap our hands and thank God for peace. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Lord, we thank you tonight for all that you're going to do. We're here, the Lord, and we're hungry. And you said to the disciples years ago, I will not send them away fasting, lest they faint in the way. And the Lord, we know that you will not send us away fasting. You cannot stand to see one of your hungry, spiritually hungry children. You will give them what they need. The Lord, let not my frailty be a factor in the ministry of the Holy Ghost on tonight. Let your spirit minister to our hearts. And we'll give you the glory. And we'll give you the praise. In the name of Jesus. Thank God. Let everybody say thank God. Thank God. Amen and amen. And you may be seated in the house of the Lord. What a wonderful, wonderful privilege it has been to attend the AIM Convention. And we do give high recognition and love and respect to the chairman of AIM, the bishop who shared. Let's grab our hands and praise God for the Bishop Sheard, if you just come and spend the time for a moment, I just want to do something. I want the staff, the auxiliary leaders, all involved in the AIM Convention to please stand, please stand. I want to see Sister Valerie Daniel Carter, I don't know whether she's here by her in the audience, but she's been out of this very special expression of love and appreciation for you, Mr. Chairman. To let you know how much the Sheard, the, the AIM organization, uh, and the staff of AIM and the auxiliary leaders of AIM appreciate your excellent leadership. I'm sure that this is a small package, but I'm also aware that 15 come in small packages. And we just want to share our love with you. Let's give our chairman of AIM an applause. I want to say for eight years, he has effectively and successfully led the AIM Convention. Every aim has been a big success. And we praise the Lord for the excellent manager of the administrative leadership, talents, and abilities that you possess. And I'm sure the Lord has much more for you to do in the future. May we clap our hands one more time and praise God for him. Well, I all the members of the town board, Mrs. Brooks, Mrs. Maxwell, Mrs. Haynes, Mrs. Wells, Mrs. Green, Mrs. McKinney, Mrs. White. Bishop Daniel, let's praise God for the entire General Board. Our team, if you were sitting on some of our board members, you would think we were having a family reunion. We sat around the table and laugh and enjoy one another. Take care of the business of the church, and I want to say that this board is leading us into the first annual CTA audit for the Church of God in Christ. Let's clap our hands and praise God for me. I'm so happy for their excellent leadership. Also, I want to say that this board has authorized us to, as we have remodeled, the rebuilding a building that on our campus was vacant and unused for over 30 years. Still, the board has authorized the remodeling of that building and you are truly was blessed out of the generosity that you share with me to give the first $100,000 toward the remodeling of that building. And the work is been done, and believe me, the most beautiful building on the entire campus of our Mason Temple. We have another building, uh, the Mason Building, the Lydia Mason Building. That is also in terrible disrepair and repair and has not been used for more than 30 years. And even if I gave $100,000 last year to the Mount Bali building, talk of what you've been able to do on this night. You've enabled me now to write a check this week for $100,000 to the end of the Mount of the Lydia Mason building. I'm so thankful for your generosity and for your support of my ministry. I'm a strong believer that if God can get it through you, 
God will give it to you. All right, all right. But you have to tell your neighbor those words. If God can get it through you, if God can get it through you, God will get it to you. God will get it to you. God of the entire AIM organization, yeah. and all of these wonderful like service leaders who are doing such an excellent, excellent job. I won't call all of their names, but this AIM convention is the result and the combination of the impact and involvement and hard work a large number of individuals. And these individuals who sit on the front row to my right have made just a vital and vital contribution. Let's clap our hands and praise God for each and every one of them. To our national officials, Bishop Miles, Bishop Moody, and all of the leaders of the church, Bishop Shear, the Council of Bishops, and well, let's praise God for all the bishops of the church. They're here in such large numbers. I appreciate that. They could have caught pain and left town today, but they stayed to support and to be with yours truly. And I appreciate them so very much. Let's give our bishop one more round of applause. Now the women they really is in the house. Let's praise God. Amen, amen. I want to encourage you young people, all, all, all the young people who are not married. I want you to know I'm praying for you. Uh -huh. I'm praying for you. I'm praying for you. All you young ladies who are not married, all the young ladies who are not married, please stand. All young ladies who are not married. Whoa. All right. All the young men who are not married, please stand. All the young men. That's all right, Bishop. <laughs> <laughs> now just look around. Just look around. Stop! 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 Yes. Stop! 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 Tell them I'm praying for you. I'm praying for you. I'm praying for you. When you do select a person to marry, would you please marry somebody who loves the Lord like you? Amen. Woo! Yeah. Woo! Would you please marry somebody who believes about church like you believe? Woo! Yes. Amen, Bishop. Two cannot walk together. Unless they agree. Except they agree. Yes. <laughs> and it was the past a convention, one of the contentions of this A convention, a youth convention years ago. But I was standing in the lobby of the convention, and one of the most beautiful young ladies I'd ever seen in all my life came walking. Damn it, Bishop. I said to my friend that very night, I'm going to marry that girl. All right. <laughs> and by God's wonderful grace, I did, and I don't regret one moment. Yes. One moment. Yeah. Thank you. 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 I've got very, very special guests. I'm so very excited about that fact. Thank God to Brother Matthew Dunaway, who is going to lead this wonderful cruise with the mission to the nation of Haiti, a nation that we love very, very much. We're in the process of completing five buildings. The orphanage was rebuilt. The missionary home has been.